fantastic opening ceremony on Sunday night. Went to the European qualifier for the Olympic Games and ran into Alexander Kizniak. And he's up against a home fighter. There's the cheer for Almir Memic. Young fighter. Saw him at the Youth World Championships in Kyoto earlier this year. He lost in the quarterfinals to Vasily Kavarin of Russia. Kavarin, a clever, cute fighter. Picks his punches really, really well. Calm, good in the pocket. No shame in losing to him, none whatsoever. Uh, he was up at 81 kilos for that. He's now down at 75. And again, like Motoa Karabali, he looks good on it. Probably should never really have been up at light heavyweight. Was at the European under-22s. Didn't go deep in that competition back in June. Serbian national champion. So Richardson has got, as I say, a home fighter to contend with here. I remember seeing Richardson in the Three Nations and the GB Championships as well, I'm pretty sure, against Ramtin Musa both times. Good fights, good fights against his now GB teammate. So Richardson of England in red, Memic of Serbia in blue. Richardson with height advantage here, he's the Southport. Memic in the orthodox stance. looking to try and come forward and work the body there Richardson just threw left hand down the middle I think might have been partially blocked opening 30 seconds for the most part these two just standing off each other looking for a right to the body there Memic comes forward there the Serbian quite square as he came in just looking to just let his hands go the referee having a word with Richardson about a touch of holding there, maybe. Right hand from Memich was caught by the left glove of Richardson, who fires a good left hand into the body. Heads almost coming together on the inside. Memich, a, a physical, muscular kind of fighter. Right hand to the body there from Memich, dips his head as he comes in. Left hand there was well timed from Richardson and the uppercut up the middle too. When he just takes a little step out and gives himself a touch of room, he might be able to catch Memic on the way in because Memic does tend to kind of ball forward. If Richardson holds his ground, then he's going to find it awkward because he won't really have enough space. But if he can back up as Memic comes forward, as he did there, then he's in business. Left hand off the ropes there, off the back foot from Richardson. And a nice one-two there from him again. Memic comes in a little bit clumsily. Richardson steps to the side, looks for the one-two. A right hand got through there from Memic in the middle of all of that, into the final minute. What he tends to do, Memic, a little bit is dip at the waist as he comes forward, but then come up once he gets into range. He brings that chin up a little bit when he starts to punch. Good example of it there. When he gets up close, he just really straightens up. Right hand there from Richardson. Left hand, rather. Memich trying to just rip to the body with the right hand into the final 30 seconds. Memich trying to get onto the inside. That's really where he wants it. Caught by a left hand on the way in there by Richardson. Memich with a left that could possibly have scored there, I think. Final few seconds, people just massed around ringside here, giving Memic their full support. There's a cut on the right-hand side there. As we look at it, that's the left-hand side of Memic's face, just a little nick on the corner of the eye. A lot of applause from the Serbian crowd. He came forward a lot there, Memic. He was quite untidy, I thought the cleaner punching there came from Richardson. Well, Memic gets it. Memic gets it across the board there. 10-9 with all five of the judges. He, he had the tempo. He did have work rate there. He, he came forward. He did get through with someone. I'm not saying he didn't. 
but I thought Richardson just as he took those feet out a little bit got onto the back foot picked him off a couple of times on the way in I thought did the cleaner punching it was kind of high octane from Emic and there's good right hand there as I say I'm not saying he didn't have success in that round he did have some success but all five cards going his way anyway that's what's in the books I think Richardson has got to, he's got to lift the work rate here a bit. I think it was the greater activity of Mamic in that opening round that, that saw him get it. The footwork there for Richardson just makes Mamic misses, he comes forward. Mamic trying to keep that head on the move. Left hand down the middle from Richardson, just about got there. Mamic just comes forward, keeps coming forward, throws a, a right hand lead almost in the end. Referee talking to Richardson about heads coming together. It's, it's Mamic really who's bringing the head in a little bit lower. I think that cut must have been caused by a head clash. I didn't see the indication from the from the referee Mamic again there just commits completely commits to his attacks Richardson with a straight left hand is looking to pick his punches carefully and be very precise maybe just needs to let those hands go a bit more Mamic just trying to crawl all over Richardson there in the neutral corner right hand on the inside from Mamic Right hand from Richardson, didn't quite land. Combination there from Richardson. One of those got through. Clean, Mamic again, just trying to rough house on the inside. That's what he's done for the most part in this fight and it is hard to tell exactly what lands there from where I was sitting in that particular exchange. Nothing really got through clean but it's aggressive. Into the final minute of round two again. Not much in this single right hand there from Emich. Jerks the head back of Richardson. That's uh, an easy one for the judges to see. Straight left there from Richardson. Into the last 30 seconds. Just shaping with the left hand there, Richardson didn't let it go. Mamic launches a massive overhand right there from, from way back, steps in. And again, just comes forward, the feet cross a little bit there, but the fists kind of mirror the movement of the feet. When he comes forward, he just keeps coming forward. Good left hand there from Richardson. Right at the end of the round. He needs that round, Richardson, to level up and give himself a chance in the final round. And he's got it with four out of the five judges there. So this is levelled up at 19 apiece on four cards. 20 points to 18 for Mamic, so he's got that one in his pocket. It comes down to the other four. He needs two of them. Richardson needs three of them. I think one apiece, which is effectively what that is, give or take after two rounds, is, is a fair reflection. I thought Richardson probably had a better round in the first round, to be honest, than he did in the second. But either way, that sets it up nicely going into the third and final round. So that slight advantage to Almir Memic. Timeout called by the referee. Now what's going on? There's a few things on the ring apron that they want removed. By the Serbian coaches. So four level cards going into this final round. Almir Memic of Serbia in blue. Lewis Richardson 
of England in red. Memich needs two of those four cards to go through. Richardson needs three out of four. Little bit messy in the opening stages. Referee just warning the pair of them about holding. They were both as guilty as each other there, really. They just kind of fell into each other as they do again here, trying to find a bit of room. Richardson trying to work that left hand if he can. Memic pushes him off in the end. The referee just lets him get on with it, which is good. Long left from Richardson. Hit the gloves. Good stiff jab there from Memic. Found the head of Richardson. Minute down in round three. Good atmosphere to this one. Decent crowding today as well. Big arena this, but plenty of noise around ringside. Right hand there, I think, did get through from Almir Memic. He's got a very awkward kind of style, an aggressive, smothering sort of style. He doesn't land loads clean himself, but it's difficult to land clean on him. Left hand there, got through from Richardson as Memic came forward. The crowd were enjoying the fact that Memic was, was pouring in again, but he definitely got caught there on the way in. Left uppercut comes through, the gum shield has come out there. I think it's Memich's gum shield. I think dislodged by, by an uppercut there from Lewis Richardson. So midway through the round, almost exactly these two get a chance just to suck some air in. So 86 seconds for these two. Their opening fight in the World Championships. Memich marauding forward again, but got caught by a left hand there from Richardson as he fell short with a right. Richardson just turning in the centre of the ring. Maybe caught him with a left there, Memich. Memich gets in tight up close. The heads clash together. I think Memich physically is, is feeling this a bit more than Richardson. A minute remaining. Richardson looking to try and aim that left uppercut. Mouth hanging open there of Memich. He's just pouring everything into this, the Serbian fighter. But if Richardson could hold his technique together towards the end here, then he could have some joy, I think. Memich, though, lands one, just as I say that. Nice combination there, though, from Richardson. Good finish to the fight. He looks for the uppercut again there, Richardson. Don't know if it landed really clean. Nice straight left hand there from Richardson. And then just as he was trying to work those hands again, Melmic was slightly too close to him, slightly too tight to him. Combination to the chest there from Richardson. Well, I think he's having a good final minute here. Melmic is giving this absolutely everything. But the technically better fighter of the two, there's no doubt that that's Richardson. We've seen that all the way through, but Memich has been full of aggression, full of purpose. He's awkward, he's difficult, he's muscular. The bell goes at the end of the fight. Memic raises the gloves there. He needs two of those four level cards. Richardson needs three of them. Memic, as I've been saying, poured everything into that final round. Thought there was some good punching from Richardson in that final minute when Memich maybe just started to come apart a little bit. It's tight. It's tight. I would shade the red corner. Memic gets it, Memic gets it by split decision, four to one. And he did what he needed to do, he got what he needed to get in that final round. I thought it was close, I thought it was close all the way through. Not an easy fight to score.
because of the styles really. Mamic is always coming forward. As I said, he's ungainly, he's awkward, he's throwing loads of punches. Difficult at times to tell exactly how many are landing. Richardson, it's easier to tell when he's landed because he's that more technically correct kind of fighter. So maybe that has a bearing. It is definitely easier to tell when someone like Richardson lands because he lands from that kind of distance, from range. You can see it more clearly. It was a close fight. Memich is the man who goes through. 